so guys today i'll be showing you how to achieve this look this is a corkscrew it's an easy beginner tutorial if you are a beginner this is an easy tutorial for you so firstly you section the hair and then you part it in so guys um you see the wool you don't use the same length the other length is gonna be shorter than the the, the other part of the wool so you just use the longer wool to loop through the hair and then you just tie the hair when you are done with the bottom you just use a small section of your wool to tie your hair so it doesn't have to so it doesn't unravel so guys if you have any questions please leave them in the comment section and if you get anything from the video please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to share the video so you loop until you uh, your desired length or until the end of the small wool that is how you measure you measure by the small wool how long you want your no crooks good to be so guys if you have any questions don't leave them don't forget to leave them in the comment section i will be happy to hear from you so that is how you tie your bottom and then you just cut the excessive hair so and then when you are done with looking through your hair you just come and tie it like that you just tie it like that don't use any pressure or any force and then you use the same wool you're using to tie your hair at the bottom to tie the last part so it doesn't unravel see how i'm gonna tie the hair here and then you just tie the last part like that so it doesn't unravel And then here I cut the um, the wool after I'm done with the corkscrew but then you can cut it even before as long as you leave small here that you can use in order to tie again the last part the, those small this small here that I'm cutting here you can even just bend use some small okay if you're not careful enough then you're gonna bend the hair but then you can use like small fire to to bend the hair so guys this is how you start i'm gonna keep on repeating the process until you get it right and i so hope you get it right so this is how you start and then you just do one thing the whole time you're just looping it you just look through and then when you are done looping through 
you cut the hair and you must tie those hair This is how you tie the hair at the bottom and then you lock your screw. This is the screw and then firstly you can just cut the hair as long as those excessive hair are not going to be there. Then you just tie your hair like that. I so hope you guys are getting what I'm trying to say. Sorry about my way of trying to explain but I so hope you get it so this is how you start you first start so I'm gonna leave another link in the description box so you can see how I've sectioned the hay and how I've used my gel to section to have these nice sections uh, it's because of didn't want to take too much time with the video alone so yeah if you want to see how I've sectioned the hair please you just keep on repeating the same steps that I've showed you guys otherwise I do not have any better explanation but if you have any questions please leave them in the comment section I'll be glad to answer from you I'll be glad to answer you. So guys, I so hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like it, comment, and subscribe to the channel. okay guys i so hope you are enjoying the video so far and please don't forget to like commenting and sharing the video so this is the last part of the video you i okay i have this is how you start this is the start this is how you just start. This is what you do throughout. In fact,
this is how you just um, do your corkscrew but if you have any questions guys don't forget to leave them in the comment section if you like the video please please like it comment share please engage with me in the comment section please like my videos i really appreciate your support throughout and i would like to say thank you to everyone who have subscribed to my channel i so hope you guys um continue supporting me i'll be bringing you more content So guys, thank you for watching until this far. Thank you very much. I really appreciate your support. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. I'll be bringing you more tutorials. I so hope you've enjoyed this. Please keep well.